A very welcome to you, Om Shanti, to all of you. We are here to discuss today's 17th July's Godly Blessing. Godfather wants us to stabilize in silence. Now, many people all around the world they think about silence as something which we do about this. I don't talk to you, so it is silence. No, this is not silence. Silence means inner silence. The chitter and chatter which is going on inside our mind. We are thinking about the past, we are thinking about the future, we are thinking about the present, what to do and we have so many insecurities and so many question marks. When we receive the seven day knowledge in which God created the new world, the seven day, one hour each day knowledge of Brahma Kumaris, the chitter chatter reduces to a lot of extent and the remaining which we reduce is through meditation. So God here says, may you experience the power of silence by stabilizing in the elevated stage beyond sound as a master seed. God is the seat, I am a master seat, I am with him in the supreme abode or Param Dham or Nirvan Dham or Alam Arvaha or we can say Shiv Lok also or Brahma Lok. The elevated stage of being beyond sound is a lovely and unique powerful stage that is beyond all physical attractions. That means we will not think about anything physical whether it's money, whether it's our looks, whether it's somebody whom we are attracted to whether it's clothes, whether it's food, whether it's anything of this world and we are completely in silence in that world in the seed form. That's where our complete power is there, our complete focus is there and we are having a sixth sense which is getting activated. God then says when you stabilize in this elevated stage for even a second the impact of that is even while doing everything throughout the day you will especially experience the power of silence in yourself. Even if for a second you go up and you sit in Param Dham, in complete silence and you're with the seed, by being a master seed, you will experience silence, you will have so much of power. It's like having God along with you or calling Him along with you or having Him along with you as a friend. Then God says this, this stage is called <clears throat> the Karma Teet stage. That means you're not thinking about anything in the world. You're not asking God for anything. You're not asking God to resolve anything in your life. And you are just over there in love with him. The full stage of being equal to the father. This is the master seed stage. The stage of a master almighty authority. By having this stage, you will experience success in every task. That means anything which comes in front of you. You can see through things. You can see through people. You can see what is the right thing to do and what is not the right thing to do. And that's what we learn in Brahma Kumari is a powerful way of meditation that you go beyond your body you do an astral travel and you sit in that world for as long as possible. And God said just one second is more than enough. So you can sit over there for as long as possible. That's the love, that's the power which you receive from God. I'm feeling it right now. Talking to you, being over there through this eye. These two eyes are over here. So you can practice this. It's beautiful, it's powerful. Om Shanti with this.